hello guys and welcome back to the channel so now guys the plot thickens with regards to what exactly is happening uh to mamandaura as guys i bring you this mamandaura quarantined in london speaks to buhari so uh a lot of people were arguing that uh this guy is in london is he not in london but of course he is in london as i already said in a previous video so he is now in London under quarantine. So again, the headline, Mamam Daura quarantined in London, speaks to Buhari. So now let's not get into the details of the latest development in this rather intriguing story. President Mohamed Buhari's close relative, Mamam Daura, is currently in quarantine in the United Kingdom. It was gathered that he was flown out of the country last week over health concerns, but a new video shared on Twitter by the personal assistant to the president on new media, Bashir Ahmed, shows a physically well Daura as he walks around a living room speaking in Hausa into a mobile phone. He was speaking with President Buhari, assuring him that he was in good health. A translation of Daura's end of his telephone conversation in the video attached to the tweet reads as follow. The governor came the day before I left. He came on condolence visit in respect to Samilia Isa Fantua. Yes, the day before. Yes, it is true. Ami. It was widely reported last Wednesday that the 79-year-old was hurriedly flown abroad to receive medical attention for symptoms resembling C-19. Ahmed later tweeted, No iota of truth in the earlier story that Malam Maman Daura was flown to London for emergency medical attention. He is hailed and hurty so that hill and hurty seems to be their go-to phrase you recall of course when uh buhari was flown to london this same london when he was at uh, uh under comatose po uh, po uh, position uh, when he was flown to london this lie mohammed was going around the whole country telling us that it was hill and hurty only for buhari to come back from london to tell us that he has never been as ill as he was. He is ill and hurty. Nigerians should disregard that story. Dara's son also debunked the report, stating, Our father, contrary to all the noise out there, was not rushed out as an emergency. He was not packaged as a health emergency, as being insinuated by some fake news peddlers so the plot continues to thicken he is in london we know that he's in london uh, uh even though there's our uh, travel restrictions uh within nigeria we know that and he's in london of course uh on only under conditions that would have uh, uh been medical because th those are the reasons that they would allow flight out of the country so we know that too so now we know that it's london yes we know that there are travel restrictions within the country yes we know that exceptions are made for medical emergencies yes so if we put together all we do know then we can see the leanings of this story because it is only leaning in one direction and if you then add the antecedents of uh uh, uh Kiari and uh, Isa Fantua etc and the whole heap of them then already you yourself can just extrapolate from what is known to get a good idea of what's happening to uh, Mamandaura but the plot continues to thicken and I'm sure the truth will come out uh, fairly soon as it always does within the Nigerian space luckily they were able to get him to London because of course the medical services in London are second to none that was the place that uh, rescued uh, Buhari's life so they have uh, gone on a second uh, rescue mission for his uncle conversations in the comment section the plot continues to thicken regarding the state of health of mamandaura the president of nigeria's uh, relative come share thought so i'll leave you here carry this conversation on with you in the comment section but here i say peace